Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. Today we will learn the calculation of net present value on Microsoft Excel. Here are two projects. This is proposed project A. Period zero to eight year. This is cash flow. This is initial cash flow two thousand and from first year to eighth year. These are the cash inflows 500 200 300 300 300 400 400 and 800 this is project b project p period 0 to 8 cash flow this is initial cash flow mean it's an investment in a project and these are the cash inflows in eighth years as you know capital budgeting minimum project is more than minimum project's life is more than one year mostly these projects are longer so this is eight eight year project project a and project b we will take decision on the base of net present value first we will calculate net present value of project a then we will calculate net present value of project b net present value of project a Here we will calculate. So click on the function bar. Here click, these are the formulas. Here click our NPV. This is the rate. What is rate? Rate is a discounted rate, opportunity rate in which investors or a firm can get minimum rate. So this is minimum required rate that a company want minimum this required rate rate this opportunity cost that is 10 percent so we will click this and then click on the value we are calculating calculating project a so select these and then enter this is not a completed result then again add initial investment then again enter so this is our net present value of project a that is positive so this project is considered to be acceptable then we will calculate npv of project b npv of project b Here we will calculate NPV of project B. Again, click on function bar. Also, you can uh, calculate it manually. This is formula equal to NPV, then bracket open. And uh, here we will put the rate. Rate is 10%, discount rate, then comma then we will put the values these are the values of project b cash inflows in eighth year and then bracket close and enter so this is the this is not complete then we will add initial cash flow this is initial cash flow then enter so this is the net present value of project b that is dollar 122 this is in minus this is a negative value this project is not considerable so we will accept the project a we will accept the project a here project project A is acceptable on the basis of net present value project A is acceptable let this is a 
clear difference between two projects this is minus this is positive if net present value is positive then we will accept the project if net present value is negative we will reject the project let's see uh, let us change the values here for example cash flow is 400 and uh, 300 then in this case net present value of B is greater we will accept the project B if the cash flow is this in this case Now both are positive. If this is the cash inflow of project B, then both project has positive values. In this case, we will accept the project A because it is the most profitable than project B. So in this way, you can calculate net present value on the exit. Thank you and uh, please sub my channel and uh, like it and share it thank you have a nice time